Hello everyone, and welcome to my The Young and the Restless official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Wednesday, July 10 spoilers for The Young and the Restless indicate that Nate Hastings will question Audra Charles about why she chose to choose Kyle Abbott as her co-CEO in light of their tumultuous past. Before taunting Nate about maybe being jealous, Audra will highlight Kyle's experience and act as like she can manage him. But since Kyle tries to push her out, Audra will finally acknowledge that she is already being attacked. When Nate questions Audra about why she doesn't just fire Kyle, she will clarify that Kyle was chosen for the position by her secret investor. Audra is still unwilling to reveal the identity of that investor, so Nate will consider all of this and advise that it seems like too much work. Summer Newman will become enraged at the Abbott estate because Kyle chose not to tell her about his intention to move out. Since Glissade's base is in Paris, she won't allow Kyle to bring Harrison Abbott there. Kyle will make jokes about how wonderful Paris is in the winter and then tell Summer to go rest because he's not going anywhere. Summer will accuse Kyle of not taking things seriously after he makes more snide comments throughout this conversation. Summer will lose her mind at Kyle's selfish desire to avoid Jack Abbott and Diane Jenkins Abbott at the expense of Harrison's stability. While Kyle will counter that Summer has no say over where he resides, she will assert that she does have a voice over Harrison. Kyle will acknowledge that he's attempting to have empathy after Daniel Romilotti Jr.'s incident, after hinting that perhaps that's not the case, Summer will be upset that Daniel and Kyle have been discussing her behind her back. Summer will also pretend on Wednesday's Law and R episode that Kyle is less interested in thinking about Harrison's best interests and more interested in hanging out with bedroom pal Audra and babysitter Claire Grace. After Summer vents her frustrations about Kyle's poor choices, she'll say that he's providing her with leverage to pursue primary custody. Since Summer isn't even Harrison's real mother, Kyle will tell her to quit making threats. Kyle will push Summer to bring up custody disputes as she is sure to lose. Harrison will eventually be picked up from camp by Claire, who will then reveal that he is in the backyard and hasn't heard anything. Kyle will apologize for all the drama this summer and invite Claire to go for a stroll with him after Summer departs. While Kyle will be happy that Claire is in Harrison's life in addition to his own, Claire will be concerned that she is contributing to the issue. When Heather Stevens gets over with him, she'll sound depressed about her job search and say maybe she should go see Paul Williams in Portugal. Daniel will determine that if Lucy Romilotti agrees, they could make the trip into a family vacation. Before Lucy arrives at Sharon Newman's home with a bracelet she wishes to give Faith Newman, she will browse through the pictures in Cassie Newman's scrapbook. Lucy will see the scrapbook and wonder whether those are pictures of Marie Copeland when she was younger while she waits for Faith to get back from a trip with her pals. When Sharon explains that Maria had a twin named Cassie, who died in a car accident when she was 14, Lucy will apologize and ask Sharon about Cassie's personality. Faith will take the bracelet when she gets home and arrange to see Lucy later. Faith will appear anxious to get Lucy out of the way so she may inquire about the scrapbook that is available. Faith will worry that it's her fault for asking too many questions the other day because Sharon has been acting more emotional over Cassie lately. Before Faith departs, Sharon will provide comfort after acknowledging that sometimes all she needs is a good weep. At the end of the scrapbook, Sharon will remove a picture of herself with Cassie and Nick Newman. Sharon will leave the cabin looking a little nervous after she puts it in her purse. Summer will confront Daniel in the coffee shop for speaking to Kyle and giving the impression that she is illogical. Daniel will make hints that Summer is overreacting and recommend that rather than starting a custody dispute straight away, they should have a calm discussion. Summer is going to act like she can't possibly reason with Kyle, especially while he's putting her biological mother status in her face. Summer is about to stomp out, and Sharon will arrive shortly after to update Daniel on Lucy's earlier visit. Daniel won't know if Lucy is prepared to accept her dad's guilt 
until Sharon says she told Lucy about Cassie without providing any information about the crash. This will reassure Daniel. Lucy will return and speak with Heather, mentioning that she had heard about Cassie from Sharon. Lucy is going to look confused and suspicious since Heather will point out that Daniel has been taking a long time to move past what happened. Stay tuned for our predictions on Lucy's reaction, as the young and the restless spoilers indicate that she will undoubtedly find out more information regarding Cassie's final night on Earth. Spoilers for Wednesday, July 10, 2024's episode of The Young and The Restless are available. Sharon Newman Rosales is likely to be troubled by her background, according to fans. Nate Hastings queries Audra Charles' choice to collaborate with Kyle Abbott. Daniel Romilotti Jr. also takes a decision regarding his future. The Wednesday, July 10 spoilers for Sharon Newman Rosales haunted Y and R indicate that Sharon will be plagued by her past. Sharon started using a different kind of bipolar medication. Though it is a newer medication with fewer potential side effects, this one belongs to the same class of mood stabilizers that Sharon used to use. Regretfully, while she's been by herself, Sharon hasn't been feeling well. Sharon then experiences episodes of severe agitation. Although she downplayed the severity of the unsettling symptoms, Sharon confided in Nick Newman, Joshua Morrow. It appears that things will worsen before they get better, according to a voicemail Sharon left for her doctor later. Sharon's history should be haunting her on Wednesday. Having Nate Hastings untrustworthy, Will Nate question Audra now that they're over? Nate will acknowledge that it is absurd for Audra and Kyle to co-manage Lissade as co-CEOs. Although Audra intends to work from Paris, Kyle is expected to remain in Genoa City. Victor Newman appeared to have his scheme complicated when Audra and Kyle explained the method to him. Is Victor possibly hoping Audra and Kyle will share a bed? Why does he insist on having Kyle and Audra work in the same city so closely? The Moral Dilemma of Audra Charles According to Wednesday, July 10 spoilers for The Young and the Restless, Nate will doubt Audra's choice. Nate is currently attempting to educate Audra the true meaning of friendship. Recently, Nate has emphasized the need of candor in friendships. It appears that Audra may have to reveal Victor's secret or jeopardize her friendship with Nate. Daniel will also make a significant decision on his future on Wednesday, July 10. Daniel has a fascinating past, aside from the romantic triangle involving Lily Winters and Heather Stevens. On Wednesday, July 10, 2024, which narrative are you most excited to see? For Audra, Nate, Kyle, and Victor, what predictions do you have? For Daniel, Lily, Heather, and the other Genoa City citizens, what does the future hold? So what do you guys think about this update? Let me know in the comments below. And if you like my videos, please press like and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time.